Hey guys, it's your girl Ahavaya, also known as Juliet. This video is an update on my Synapses Exotica. It's a request from one of my subscribers, and so here it is. Alright, so I made a big boo boo. I was trying to bottom water my Synapses Exotica. And um, everything was going well. I had it in the bucket. It was, um, I think it was um, extremely dry. Like it was really dry to the point that it wasn't really absorbing the water fast enough. So I just filled up the bucket as high as the pot and uh, left it in there for about 10, 15 minutes. Came back. I picked it up, picked it up by the side and this part broke off and it dropped right back into the bucket and now this pot is in peace oh sorry i accidentally ended it, the video but yeah this pot is in pieces now and um yeah but it looks like it actually needs to be repotted anyways um it kept drying out too quickly every time i would water it you know it would be like a, a day or two and then i need to water it again i'd be getting yellowing leaves and whatnot so yeah but looking from the side looks like it's somewhat root bound so i'm going to have to repot it but this is what it looks like for those who um, wanted I have a couple requests of people that wanted to see the progress of this plant and um, see how it is doing so here are the main stems that I had prior to putting in new cuttings so there was this one here this this right there oh sorry it was this then this then this cutting and this one here that i started out with and here are new cuttings that i put in recently so there's one right here, another one here, another one there, and another one here. So I added four to it, but it's doing well. As I said, it um, was getting a lot of yellowing leaves, uh, but now I see that it's probably because it doesn't have any, much, any more space in there, uh, or it needs more room to grow, actually, and to um, absorb to get more um, dirt to absorb water so that it could be hydrated but yeah I just wanted to show everyone what it looked like before I repot it into a bigger pot a bigger less cracked <laughs> and broken pot but it's doing well guys so. All right guys, so this is what the inside of the pot is looking like. Um, looking at the array of roots here. Um, it's so pretty guys. But yeah, I think this needs to repot. It needs more space so that it can grow out some more. It needs more soil in it so that it can grow. Now, um, at this point, I thought that this was the end of the video guys, but I noticed something take a look here guys um, so as you can see there is a break in one of the vines and um, I need to fix this I noticed this a couple days after I repotted it and um, I thought that something had fallen on it but I think it happened when the pot dropped back into the bucket um, that first um, part of the video so I'm gonna have to do something about this if I don't, this um, stem 
or this vine is going to die off so I might as well use this as an opportunity to propagate it so I'm gonna cut it and put it in some water and go from there it looks like I'm gonna be able to get about three new stems from this I'm gonna cut here right there and up here and that'll give me three new stems or three new vines so here I'm about to give my synapses a chop now I'd like to apologize ahead of time um, for this angle that you're about to see my tripod broke a little while ago and I just now been able to replace it and this is um, this was recorded prior to that so sorry about the angle it's not the greatest I know I'm so sorry uh, but you know a girl's gotta do what a girl's gotta do all right so here I am giving you this a chop this particular part has the new leaf growing from it so I'll chop it right about here and then I'll place this in water So I had to put more water in it because the uh, stems part wasn't really reaching properly. So now I have them all in here and they're good to go. So this will, these will probably grow roots within the next week or so. And then we'll I don't know. I'll look to see if I'm going to pot them back into the same plant or if, um, or sorry, into the same pot or if I will start a new pot with these three stems. So I know I haven't given y'all a tour of my new um, living area, but um, this is what it's looking like in this corner over here by the sliding doors. And this is where I keep my synapses so it gets plenty of bright indirect light. Um, it has a period of during the day where it um, has direct lighting, but it is shielded by this sheer curtain that I have up here and um, that's about that but at this this particular shot here that I'm giving you of this uh, um, <clears throat> of the plan is before I did that snip and at this point in time that I'm recording this voiceover and finishing up this video um, one of the, the the vines or one of the stems um, has grown roots and I've repotted it right next to the original um, location of that I cut so um, I will keep you guys updated on this plant and um, I will show you this update in a different video at another time but for now thanks for watching guys hope y'all have a lovely day and uh, take care of yourselves and each other all right